Hey guys, Joe here, and welcome to another episode of Minecraft on the Riff Raff server. Today, I'm over at a little thing that you have not seen. Also, tab menu, because Minecraft 1.8 is finally here. Yay! Um, first of all, let me cough real quick. Excuse me. <coughs> I just wanted to start this video off and uh, apologize. I would just like to start off the video by saying I am sick, or at least I'm starting to get sick. I woke up today with a sore throat, and progressively over the course of the day... My throat has just betrayed me, and it is sore, and I'm not feeling well. So bad to the fact, or to the fact, I, th I think I'm probably going to call in sick for work tomorrow, because I feel absolutely god awful, and I cannot be coughing all over food that I'm supposed to be cooking. So, with that being said, uh, yeah, sorry I'm getting a cold. I'm pretty sure Chris gave me the cold. Um, I think. He's trying to sabotage my YouTube channel. Now, I don't have proof, but I'm pretty sure of it. And I don't know about you, but that's a sick thing to do, no pun intended. Like, what kind of sick human being would sabot or try to sabotage somebody's YouTube channel? I have no clue. But, um, anyways, today I am starting out over here. This is a little PvP arena that, um, me and Jacob put together yesterday. Um, he built a 64 by 60 well, I was gonna say 64 by 64 but yesterday during building, we realized he made this off, and made a 64 by 63 so that kind of messed up the entire project, but, we did it nonetheless. Um, he made this little 64 by 63 cobblestone platform, and he wanted to make a, um, uh, a PvP arena almost completely out of cobblestone, so we kind of faced that challenge together by ourselves, um, and this is what we came up with, and I think it's pretty cool. We we use like slime blocks that were recently implemented, and if you're really smooth with them, you can get around, and it's really really cool. Um, but this got me thinking, like I want to make some more arenas and stuff, and like we, me and him have already talked, and like we're gonna make several more, but. I'm going to start off on one today where I've, I've actually worked on, honestly, all day um, on a creative world where I've planned things out. But um, over here is a 65 by 65 because I don't like working in even numbers and I'm an odd fellow, so I made a 65 by... Was it you? Was it... Shut up! Shut up. Ooh, mutton. Heh. <laughs> Gonna, oh, oh, not that's uh, eh, eh, mutton. Okay, let's come over here and eat this in front of their kinsmen. Come on, get hungry. Yeah, that's what you get. Anyways, I decided I'm gonna make my own arena. Um, that was incredibly stupid, but it was okay. Um, I'm gonna make my own arena. Uh, in a 65 by 65 square, I have a little, uh, sort of little thing I'm doing over here, trying to fill in the bottom. Shut up. Shut up. There we go. Thank you. That actually worked out really nicely. Um, I have this going on. I want to put down, like, a, a second layer just so I can place blocks on top of it if I need to. Ah, hold on. I I'm sorry getting distracted so much, but did you see that sheep over there? Like, I'll try to fly, or play it back real quick, but, like... Animals and mobs have gotten really glitchy, like, I don't know what it is, like, sometimes they'll just go, like, super fast, or, like, derp out. I have no idea why they keep doing that, but, all the same, um, I'm starting off and doing this, and I decided I'm gonna make this arena, um, into four different corners, kinda like this one is. It was originally designated into four different corners, signified by the four different tower thingies, um, but this is going to be specifically four corners that you're going to you're going to be able to see the difference between each one of them. Um, but for this one, I'm going to do each square is going to be based on one of the four elements. So water, earth, fire, and air. And uh, I'm going to sort of base the buildings off of uh, Avatar: The Last Airbender. If you're on this, if you've been here a while, you probably know I adore the Avatar franchise and the story and the sister sister series and anything and everything Avatar The Last Airbender is great. Well, it's one of my favorite shows and I decided I'd base this off of it because, you know, elements and, you know, they have a really unique build style and I figure it works nice and it was kind of an interesting thing to go through today. Um, another interesting thing about that was I spent a lot of the time today making flags, or uh, not flags, banners, banners, newly implemented banners from Minecraft 1.8. I uh, went through and tried to make as close to um, sort of realistic 
um, the, the four, you know, element banners that there are in the show. Of course, a lot of, or a couple of them aren't going to be very, very, like, very similar. But I did the best that I could with the resources and the materials I had. Um, excuse me while I cough again. Jesus. <coughs> I apologize for that. I have gone a couple hours without talking due to my sore throat, and now that I'm talking again, um, it is causing my throat to have a fit and protest like a small child that got told he couldn't have McDonald's for dinner because there was food at home in the kitchen. Um, I may or may not ta be talking about myself with that in that regard from the past or... Uh, just last week, but, um, yeah, so, I'm gonna go ahead and go with the wool real quick that's necessary, um, to make each of the banners, and I'm gonna show you how I made them, um, ooh, okay, I don't get poisoned from eating raw mutton, that's nice, it's just like raw steak then, um, yeah, I'm gonna go over here and try to get all of the, uh, the, the, the wool and stuff, and all the materials that I need to make the banners, um, let's go through my little underpass I'm really proud of, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go get these, and I will come back to you in a second. Alright, so I'm back, and I have all those stuff that I need. Um, Jacob's on real quick, or Jacob is on, so, or well, he was, so, and he might be back. I needed him to sleep, and he disconnected. Either his connection was absolutely terrible, or he got off for my convenience. Um, he said he'd be over, so maybe we can get him in the episode a little bit later. Uh, but yeah, I just want to go ahead and make these banners real quick, because they're really cool. Um, I have the banner web creator website up next to me, so I hopefully won't mess this up. Uh, I need vines and lapis to make a light blue border, and then I need a golden notch apple and white to make it white, and, uh, boom. That is the water symbol flag thing. Uh, it's reminiscent of the water tribe flag a little bit. It It is a stretch, but the Mojang logo kind of reminded me of a moon, so I decided to do it. Um, next up comes Earth, which is probably the most difficult to do. Um, I'm going to be 100% honest. Uh, so let's take the green banner, and I actually put it there. And then, oh, no, nope, nah, lime dye there. So that will add a roundel? Yeah, I don't even know if that's needed, but, um, I don't think it is, actually. Uh, quickly, no, I, I don't need that. So, put that there, and then a cactus green there to make that. And Jacob's back, that's cool. So, put that up there, and then that right there. Okay, and then surround it with green so hopefully I did this right that is not where it goes hopefully I did this right BAM it is okay good so if you see an avatar you know there's the the, the circle with the uh, square in the middle this is as close as I can get it in Minecraft I think I did a pretty good job using that oxide flower to be honest um, without completely making it like super thin um, what's next the fire nation or the element fire element flag uh, I'm going to go ahead and put this back right there. Um, put that there, that there. I could put that there. And bam, bam, bam. Okay, so I think the fire one is the easiest one to do. Um, take that. Get, ooh, no. One there. Bam. Uh, bam. Bam. And then the oxide daisy. And voila! The fire flag which is super rad. Um, and next, the air flag. Excuse me while I cough yet again. <coughs> I apologize for that. Um, I think this is the most complicated one to do, um, or at least it was the most complicated one to make. I know that's a th definitely the fact. Um, so, let's put this in here. And if I'm not mistaken, we start out with a diamond shape. That's not a... That's a diamond shape! And then, um, put these across the top. I don't need one there. So put those across the top. Um, put that there. Go down the bottom. Bottom. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And then across the bottom. And voila! Pretty sure that is correct. So if I... Yeah, it's the, uh, it's not the same logo and stuff from the show of the Air Nomads. It's not the, uh... 
the sort of wind symbol. That was impossible to do. So I just did the arrow. Um, I know it's not pointy at the bottom there. It's kind of unfortunate, but you know, it, it, it's close enough and it gets that feel across and it's the Air Nomads. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put these back in here because they're not necessary. Now, these are gonna be the four different flags that uh, s sort of represent the four sections. So, I'm gonna go ahead and try to fill in some more of this cobblestone stuff and I'll come back to you when something interesting happens. So, yeah. Alright, I'm back, and after a little bit of redstone work with Jacob, that I couldn't record unfortunately because my voice hurt, um, Jesse's over here doing some shenanigans, and he said, give the viewers what they want, death. So, oh, I, I threw my sword, that's that's the opposite of what I want to do. Um, I will give them exactly what they want, so says Jesse. I'll capture you. <laughs> God, that was great. I coughed so hard I thought I was going to choke up blood. Um, if you didn't understand the reference, uh, Jesse's new skin is Zuko from Avatar, ironically, because he just powered through the series, and then I am I put on my Air Nomad skin, so he came over. <laughs> ah, that was dishonorable. Oh my god. I took away your firebending. <laughs> For good. Mom jokes? Okay, I don't understand why you named a sword that, or, yeah, I don't understand why you named a sword that, but that's definitely a thing that happened. Um, your channel is dishonorable. <laughs> Alright. Alright, guys, I'm sorry. Um, this, vo or this video has been all over. I just wanted to another, or make another video to, uh, sort of just show that I'm not completely dead. Um, I would have recorded sooner, but a problem with mine Minecraft 1.8 was a thing where I just, it was unable for me to play. Like, it was just really laggy, and I had to download Java 1.8, which I didn't even know was a thing. Um, so, once I fix my Minecraft, I can record again, which I have. Um, so yeah, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Probably a very short episode now that I think about it, um, of a little bit of antics with Jesse and then designing the flags. Um, next episode, I promise we'll work more on this. Let me see if I can get this shot first try. Come on. Skills. Yes! I am right. Right on the money. I am great at bows. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, you can come back uh, every Monday and Friday. That's when I do try to post these, but because of I am an unreliable teenager, that schedule is flexible as... Something that's very flexible. I am sick and I don't have the intention span to think of a comparison. So, hope you enjoyed this episode, and uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye bye